What's going on dudes, it's Chaos, and welcome back to the Technic Adventures, and after our last episode, it was a complete fail. Oh my gosh, it was so awful. <laughs> I'm sorry I made you guys watch that. Really, I don't know why you stuck around. <laughs> but uh, anyways, after everything that we lost, and because uh, we've used up a ton of resources trying to do this guy, or get this, uh, the Crystal and Bell Discovery Scroll, and uh, man, it took forever, but we finally, finally got it. We got Discovery of Crystal and Bell. And uh, what we can actually do with this is now that we have the discovery, we click on it and it says you can now make a crystalline bell. And uh, it takes a piece of glass and a diamond and uh, 150 viz. So, uh, what we did is I went ahead and uh, while I was waiting for all that stuff, I kind of went back and uh, I got enough viz to make a whole bunch of enchanted wood that we can use to make some more of the storage tanks. And uh, I was just using like cobblestone and a whole bunch of other just useless crap that we don't really need to... Uh, to make all the stuff, so uh, or get the get the viz that we need um, to fill up these tanks. So uh, what we did is I kind of redid everything. I kind of made this room a little bit better looking, and um, now what we can do is we can actually use uh, kind of like isolate everything and kind of just get a uh, some more uh, viz going on. So uh, let's throw down this crafting table, and uh, we're gonna go ahead and make some more tanks just so we have enough and we can start kind of just storing it up. So. Um, what we need to do is put the glass panes like this, and we'll make uh, as many as this glass is going to let us uh, make. So it looks like we should be able to make five, yeah, five of these guys. And uh, hopefully we have enough uh, enchanted wood. I think we do. But uh, it's just at least this way we can have uh, um, enough viz stored up, so if we ever need to make anything else, we can actually... Uh, you know, really start making a whole bunch of other stuff. So, um, let's do this, and we'll actually, we've got two more, um, we'll put, I don't know, we'll hang on to these two. We don't really necessarily need these right now, so we'll just do this, this, and we'll put a conduit here, and then we'll put our atomic infuser, um, right here in the corner where it was. And so now, what we can do is we can just go grab, I need to drop off a whole bunch of stuff anyway, so, um, Let's see, what all let me put away. I'll hang on to this stuff because we can throw all this in the uh, infuser or in the uh, the crucible to get some uh, viz going. And uh, we gotta see all the uh, depleted crystals that we have. It's insane. Um, that's actually from uh, getting all the wood. Uh, let's just grab all this. Uh, all of this cobblestone just a bunch of crap that we don't really necessarily need and we'll just throw it in there and uh, see how much that gives us so hopefully that's enough to uh, get the ball rolling and we can make our crystalline bell and we can go uh, uh, start harvesting these crystals and uh, really start expanding the farm a little bit and uh, I think it'll be good so uh, we'll see how much this gives us we're gonna let this kind of build up and let's see if we can uh, need to go get some glass while that is brewing, we'll go grab some glass and we'll work on see if we have enough uh, to get this crystalline bell. So we are going to grab one diamond and uh, I went ahead and harvested some of the diamonds and stuff that were down in the, uh, uh, the branch mine just because, uh, I don't know, I ended up losing them because I was putting them in there trying to get this uh, the discovery scroll and stuff like that and it was just taking forever. I ended up like I don't know if I said it a minute ago, but the jewels were actually working fairly well, like the amethyst and uh, sapphires and things like that. They were working fairly well. So um, let's see if we can get this guy going. So we just need. I guess this is gonna build up over time, and uh, I don't know. It's kind of cool. Like as it goes, it kind of lights up, and then uh, it lets us know. I guess once this fills up, that's when we'll actually get the bell. So. Um, it's definitely probably going to take quite a quite a bit of resource to get enough viz to do all that, which is insane to me. It's just a, like I don't know. It's just crazy. It takes a lot. All right. So what we are going to do is uh, see if we can grab that cobblestone. We can't, but uh, we'll go ahead and stick this crafting table up in the wall because we'll probably end up needing it a little bit more. And uh, so this is going pretty slow. But this thing is pretty cool. I, I actually I really enjoy this. It's kind of like it really kind of puts everything to the test. So um, 
Let's see about what else we can throw in here to speed the process up a little bit. Uh, cobblestone works fairly well. It's just like constant because you've always got enough cobblestone. But uh, I want to try to throw something else in there. Let's throw some more of these jewels in there and see what all we can get because the jewels are fairly... Uh, fairly common and uh, especially once we get our quarry going which is going to be tomorrow um, we should be getting a lot of return for the jewels and things like that so uh, alright so this guy is depleted already so let's throw these guys in there and uh, see what all this gives us so that is definitely filling up fairly quick but uh, for now I guess once we get the crystalline bell then we can just start throwing a bunch of just junk in in this thing and we can just get these full that way we have enough uh, enough viz stored up that we can actually uh, get everything we need so we finally got it man the crystalline bell nice I'm super excited about this it took forever and uh, I don't know but now we can actually start harvesting the crystals and things like that and uh, we can uh, really start expanding the farm so it's really nice now because we got uh, that we can actually get uh, we could get these back to begin with but uh, I guess we can't harvest the last one with the crystalline bell which is weird but uh, let's run in here, and I'm probably going to break that one down uh, anyways. Just that way uh, we can have the crystals growing in here. But now we can actually harvest all of these guys and uh, get some return on this finally. So it feels pretty good, man. Took forever. Busting my balls trying to figure this out. This stuff is so confusing. Okay, so now we've got all of these guys. And uh, we'll go ahead and throw this in here because I guess this is pretty much useless now that we already know that one and um, let's take all of we'll put the enchanted wood and stuff in here and along with that and then we'll put the well I don't know we'll hang on to the crystal and bell um, so let's go over here and I know there's some crystals in here so let's go harvest these guys and we'll see if we can actually get enough uh, crystal to actually make some more ore and things like that we can uh, put put the rest in uh, in the farm over there so you know what I'm actually gonna do too since I don't really necessarily want these growing in here I'll just go ahead and knock these off and then uh, hopefully it'll give us enough at least of a couple more different color crystals to uh, make some ore and we can we can put those back over here in the farm so um, let's run over here and we'll grab these this one and uh, I ended up breaking those off trying to use those in that thing over there which was probably a huge mistake because uh, they just ended up disappearing like crazy fast, so it was kind of pointless. And I'll we'll grab all of these guys in here, and uh, we'll come down here, grab the rest of them. I know I've got some sitting in the chest down here, and see if we can make enough ore for everything else. So we've only got these guys left. Okay, so it looks like we have enough to make another fiery. And only another fiery. Hmm. That's kind of disappointing. We need one more blue one. And two more purple ones. Tainted. Um, which I actually... We're going to make a quick adventure. I know where some of those are. Um, I think. I want to say... I don't know. I don't know. Hopefully, I'm thinking of the right ones. Alright, so now what we are going to do is we are going to throw this one in here. And I probably should have stuck it on the wall like that one, but oh well. Oh well. Alright, we'll throw these guys in here for now. And uh, what is this one? The focus? It's crap. Okay. So what all do we need? We'll throw this in there. We don't need that. And then all this other stuff. Uh, we'll just go toss in the, uh, the crucible. Crucible sounds like a badass, man. It's just like, I don't know, it's a crazy name. Uh, throw that in there, throw that in there. Hey, we actually have enough to make it vaporous, too. I didn't even see that one. Um, let's throw all this stuff in there. I can make plenty of this stuff. I have plenty of it already. And uh, throw those in there, too. Alright, so let's make one of these guys. And we'll go throw this in there. And then we'll actually go uh, uh, use the crystalline bell to snag some more of the crystals. And uh, see if we can get some more ore brewing up. Okay, so we'll put this one right there, and uh, we'll kind of just start, because like I said, I slowly want to build out to all this, and then um, I dug these out because I wanted to put some glowstone in there when we finally get down to the nether, 
but uh, I haven't really decided yet. We may end up sticking some crystals in there since crystals do emit emit light. Um, I don't know. It might be better to do that, but I'm not sure. So uh, let's run over here, and uh, it's actually quite a ways. It's over in uh, this guy over here. So we're gonna run over there and see what all we can find. And I may actually run down here. I want to say there was some down here too, but I'm not sure. Oh, nope, not this one. There's a different cave. Where is it? Oh, it's in this one. With the water. But uh, I am trying to be pretty careful about not taking all the crystals. Like uh, with these ones in here, uh, I'm not going to break them down completely. I'm just going to harvest what I can from them. And uh, we'll leave the last one in here. And we'll just remember these guys in here and we'll let them grow. So these are the guys that have been in here for a while. So we've got three of those guys, and there's one more over here. Yeah, another earthen. And okay, that looks like it's it in here. It's kind of just some random caves that were here before. So now I think we actually have enough to make another tainted crystal ore, but uh, I'm not completely sure. But uh, we'll run over here and grab the rest of these guys and then uh, see about getting the rest of it all hooked up. And uh, we should be good to go, at least now. And then uh, tomorrow, like I said, we're setting up a, our uh, quarry, uh, which will be really cool, too, because now um, we'll be able to set up, like, uh, get all of the materials and stuff that we're going to need for a while. And uh, we shouldn't have any problems. So we'll come over here. They're up in here, up, like up inside this guy. Let's see if we can actually get to them. I remember seeing them before when I was over here but I'm not completely sure where they were alright so there's some yellow ones up there I want to say there was some yeah here they are the red ones go around okay so these guys have been here for a while they're growing fairly well and uh, we'll do these like we did the other ones just a second ago um, we'll just take what we can and then the rest of them uh, we'll just kinda leave to do the thing alright so let's grab this dirt and climb up like that and okay so we can knock this guy out oh we put our crystal in bellowy okay there we go alright so now oh no we got those so let's run around and just kinda look around a little bit see if there's any more over here I don't think there is but I'm not completely sure oh no We'll see. We will see. But yeah, hopefully you guys are kind of enjoying this. I know we're kind of really getting into the uh, the mods and stuff now, which uh, I do apologize for my lack of knowledge on these mods, um, especially like how everything kind of is supposed to go down and things like that. Um, like I said, I am learning as I go, so it's kind of awkward um, <laughs> when we hit kind of a little snag like we did yesterday because that was just really, I don't know, I feel like I was underprepared and... Uh, Hopefully we won't be like that anymore, but uh, this Thumbcraft, man, it's, it's it's a bit confusing. Alright, so let's run in here. Let's see what's going on in here. Hmm? Anything? Anything good? I don't see anything. Okay. Hmm. What is all that stuff? I guess that's oil, but I was thinking I saw something else on the other side. Let's run over here. I don't think I've actually been out this far yet. I don't think, anyway. I don't remember. I've done quite a bit of exploring. Yeah, what is all this purple crap? I think this is the taint. I haven't really seen it before. What is... Let's see. Let's see what we can do with this. Yeah, this guy. Oh, that sounds disgusting. Can we harvest this? Man, this takes forever. What is it? What is this thing? Oh, we don't get anything? Oh, hey, look. There's a whole bunch more of this stuff. What is it? Oh my gosh, that sounds so gross. That is disgusting sounding. Squishy. Okay, so what do we do with this? Anything? 
I guess I don't know too much about the taint. I know that's part of the same thing that we've been doing, but I don't know what it's supposed to do. Did I get anything from these weird looking plants? Hey, what was that? Taint spores. Hmm. That sounds interesting. Hey, look, there's another monolith. Cool! Dude, what is this? What do we do? Oh, crap. Okay, um. What is this? It looks really cool, though. I guess this is just like an area with low aura? Is that what it is? I'm not really sure. I guess I don't know enough about this. It's crazy looking, though. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and leave, uh leave before we get infected with taint. I don't think you can actually get infected with taint, but uh sounds plausible. So, let's see. Can we get out of here now? Um do this. Okay, now we're good. All right, so we're going to head back to the house and uh I haven't seen any more of those crystals, so I guess this is kind of like an area with low with the crystals. But uh what's this monolith thing doing over here? Uh, this will, we need to figure these things out too and see if we can get into one of those see what all is shaking so should be pretty cool alright well I'm going to speed it up while I run back to the house real quick and then uh, we'll get back over there and we'll see if we can plant any more of these ores so I will see you in just a minute okay so now we are back and uh, we should be good to go uh, I think we actually have enough uh, I think I actually have it set on peaceful too because while I was waiting for that thing we had zombies like they're responding inside the house and trying to get out, which is really weird to me. Um, I don't know, but I think we have enough vis crystals now that we can actually. Um, let's see, where did all the other ones go? They're in here. So we have enough for the tainted, but it looks like that is it. Um, okay, well that kind of stinks, but that's okay. At least there's one more. So, okay, so now I guess we just kind of go slowly with these guys, and then uh, we'll slowly just start kind of building everything up. And uh, it should be a pretty legit farm here, after a while at least, because like, I know it does take a long time. So, uh, I'll make one more of these dudes. Like that, Tainted Vizor. And I can't, I don't know uh, if, like, I don't know, y'all are going to have to tell me if the Tainted Vizor, or the Tainted Viz Crystals are, like, bad to have in the world, because if they are... Then I will say deuce and then, you know, get them out of here. But uh, I'm not sure if it's, like, good or bad to have these guys growing. I just, I, I don't, I'm not positive on that. So, um, but anyways, I guess that's going to go ahead and complete today's episode. I know it uh, wasn't too exciting as uh, and it wasn't much of a fail as it was yesterday. But uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed. So hit that like button for me down below. Leave a comment. And uh, if you know anything about the tainted crystals and things like that or whatever, make sure you let me know. Because, um... Uh, I can only do so much research, you know, without uh, losing my mind. But, uh, anyways, I appreciate you guys watching, and uh, I think tomorrow we're going to get started on the quarry, which is going to be really cool, and uh, that'll it's going to save us a lot of time in the future. So, uh, it'll be fun to set that one up. So, uh, anyways, I will talk to you guys tomorrow, right? Peace!